we'll start off by getting our mix ready. This is the coir block that we're going to shave down. Uh, we'll start off by doing that. Doesn't do the chisel much good, but it's easy to sharpen, so that's okay. We need enough to fill a small takeaway container. Put some neo seeds in. Shoot that part of it later on. Initially, we're just getting the media ready. Need a bit more than that. looking a bit better. We've got about enough there now. Because this is a deep container we're going to put it in. I've prepared some before so I'll tip that out, mix that in together. Then we'll put it back into the container. We'll fill that with water. And super saturated. And let it sit there. Later on that'll go into the microwave for a minute. We'll sterilize that. We might even need two minutes, we'll see. Fill that with water. Down, let it soak in. We want it to be completely wet all the way through. Mix it round. Still be dryish on the bottom. That's looking better. Yep, that's wet on the bottom. We'll let that sit there for the moment. Right, now the second container. What we'll do with this one, we're going to put the other half of our seeds in sphagnum moss. This is the stuff that you buy at hardware stores. Pretty poor quality, very small, less than 100 mils per each strand. That's real sphagnum moss, over 150 mils long per strand. Look at it growing, how rich and healthy is that, as opposed to the dry stuff in here. Alright, we'll fill that up, pull it apart, tease it apart a little bit. See how we're going there, that's getting there, a little bit more maybe. Right now, we'll flood that with water. Push it down to get it soaked all the way in. So that's our two containers to put our seeds into, one with koya, one with sphagnum moss. We'll see which ones germinate first, not that that particularly proves very much, but we'll have a look and see. These are the two containers of media we prepared before, sphagnum moss, 
and the coir. Now we'll put them into the microwave for a minute, sterilize it. Put a piece of paper over the top. We'll see how hot we are. That could use another minute. They look right now, so we'll leave them there. This is the dry seed we'll be using. You can see how fine it is. We'll select some of the seed onto our finger and then lightly distribute it over the media. Not easy to pick up. But we don't want a big clump of seed anywhere. We want it to be distributed relatively evenly. Make sure we got all the seed out. Here's the one that got away. Okay. We'll press that down, making sure we haven't collected any seeds. That looks alright. That's the name of the seeds. It's a bromeliad, neoregelia, the governor's plea. We'll check back on that in a couple of weeks. We should have some germination.